Good evening, teacher. So here is the second question sa ating comment section. Hello po, ma'am. What is the trick po for the question if tangent A is equal to one-third and cotangent B is equal to two, then tangent A minus B is equal to? So just the same. Titingnan po natin kung ano yung common sa ating problem at sa ating given. Here we have tangent A is equal to one-third. At ang problem ay tangent A minus B. So, masasolve po natin dito ang A, which is equal to arc tangent ng one-third. Ayan. Then, cotangent B, we have 2. Masasolve na din po natin ang B, which is equal to arc cotangent of 2. Ayan. Arc cotangent. So, arc cot. Paano po ba yung arc cot? E di ba po yung kanina, ang cotangent natin ay 1 over tangent. So, kapag inverse po ba ay shift 1 over tangent, it's a no-no. Kapag inverse po, ang, ang equivalent po nito ay B will be equal to arc tangent of the inverse neto. Ayan. Inverse or reciprocal. Kindly take note na kapag we are dealing with numbers, pareho lang po ang ibig sabihin ng reciprocal at inverse. Pero kapag trigonometric function, magkaiba po ito. So, ililink ko po dito yung ating previous tutorial para mas malinawan po tayo. So, ready na po tayo sa ating problem. Then, we will input ang tanong po ay tangent. So, ayan. Recta na po natin. A. Where A is shift tangent of one third. Okay. Then, RB, di ba? Minus B. So, minus ang B naman po natin ay shift Tangent, one half. One half. Then, closure equals sign. The answer is negative one over seven, which is letter C. So, meron po tayong bago, R cotangent. Huwag po natin kakalimutan, ang pag-input po natin ng R cot or arc cotangent or the inverse of cotangent will be the inverse of tangent then reciprocal po ng kung anumang value ang andito. Okay? So, this is all. Thank you for watching. God bless everyone. Kindly share para mas marami po tayong matulungan. Maraming salamat po.